day Maggie Smith says, that's not a fort, that's my husband. <laughs> Do you think our memories are faulty at all? <laughs> I highly doubt it. I mean, at least the celebrities were there. Definitely Beyonce. Yes, I trust our brains as well. And I should know, I studied neuroscience in college. Yes, the wine flowed, the people cheered, but we never took our final bows. <sighs> I regret it every day. Our violent bouts of nausea right before our final long form set. We were so sick, in fact, do you remember? We had to be rushed to the Wexner Center before we went on stage. Why did we never organize another send-off? Time got away from us. We were all so wildly successful right out of college that we just never had a time to set it up. If only we had the time, if only we had the technology. Well, these last five hours have been fun, but I'm afraid the dicks don't stop on the operating table. I should get going. Same goes for the courtroom. Ugh, I gotta get out of here. I'm really burning the candle at both ends. Yes, yes. Come on, Stephen, too. Let's go home. The circle of life. It moves us all through despair and hope, faith and love. Truer words have never been spoken, Simba. Wait, what if I told you there was a way that we could go back? It's in its experimental stages, and it just might kill us all. This could be the only way for us to go back and do improv one last time. Oh my god, you invented the first time machine? How long have you been working on it? For many years, and it's secret. Would we be able to get back? My data shows that they could cryogenically freeze us after the show, and we could re-enter our lives in the year 2046, present day. I'll program Steven too to unfreeze us on this day in 2046. This all seems so crazy. It is, but it's the only way we'll be able to go back. I'm in. Me too. Me too! All oh, right! But won't there be clones of us? What if we mess up the space-time continuum? Well then, I guess we'll just have to improvise. Fair enough! Yeah! Yeah!